I also wanted to include a quick aside here because I just realized that we used uh, an enumeration uh, in the previous example, and uh, I don't think your textbook actually covers these. Uh, you may have seen these in Java, uh, but basically there are types where all of the potential values are just listed out during the declaration. So uh, we'll use these in uh, projects two uh, and beyond. Uh, they're declared in C using the enum keyword. Uh, in C, the actual values are stored as integers, and so in assembly you would just reference them uh, all the values just using those raw integers. Uh, you can actually assign integer values if desired. So here we're creating uh, an enum called day t, and we are saying that uh, Monday, our MON, is going to be 1, which means that uh, Tuesday will be 2, Wednesday will be 3, and Thursday will be 4, so forth. Um, and the primary advantage here is that we can just use these named constants instead of using the raw numbers. Uh, and so uh, if we declare midterm day uh, to be a day t that is equal to Wednesday, that's basically the same thing as creating an integer uh, that's set to the value 3. But of course, it's a little bit uh, more self-documenting to have these constants. Uh, and so we'll use these for various pieces of uh, Y86 uh, once we get to projects uh, 2, 3, and 4.